Hello everybody, this is Jaden, and today I'm going to show you how to extend your free trial period on any software on your computer indefinitely. Okay, before I uh, do this tutorial, I'm going to go ahead and tell you guys that this is not legal. Okay, now that that's out of the way, I'm going to go ahead and get on with the tutorial. In the description, there's going to be a download link to this page and you're gonna go ahead and download this software. Once you've done that, inside your downloads folder there should be a .zip. Go ahead and double click the .zip and move the contents, it's the application, to your applications folder. You can go ahead and delete the .zip now. Once the application's in your applications folder, go ahead and click go up at the finder and hold option. If you don't hold option, in between home and computer there should be nothing, but if you hold option, a hidden folder called library will appear. Go ahead and click library. The folder is hidden because there's some stuff in there that they don't want you, or Apple doesn't want you screwing with and potentially breaking your computer. Go ahead and scroll down to preferences, which is inside the library folder, and click it. I'm going to go ahead and go into this view because it's easier for you guys to see the contents of this folder that way. Now there's this application I use called Bartender, it basically cleans up what's up here. And the free trial period has ended, as you can see. It lets me buy it, enter a license, which I get from buying it, or I can just quit out. It won't let me use it anymore. Okay, so to extend the free trial period, I'm going to go ahead and find bartender.plist. Uh, the manufacturer or the people that make the software, the company name, might be in front of the name of the application, so just be careful when looking for it. Bartenders.plist is right here, so I'm going to go ahead and right click that, click open, other, go to enable and go to all applications, and find plist edit pro. Go ahead and double click plist edit pro and that'll open up the plist. You can go ahead and exit out of the preferences. Once you're in here, you're gonna go ahead and look for something that says trial start or trial date start or something to that effect. Basically, find a date that is signifying when you started the trial. Mine's right here, so once you find that, enter the current date and time minus one minute. So as you can see, today's date is August 12th. So I'm gonna change the date to August 12th. And the time is 4.57, so I'm going to change it to 4.56, and that's p.m. So once you've changed the date to the current date and time minus one minute, go ahead and exit out and hit save. The software should let you use it now. As you can see, Bartender is working. The uh, menu bar is now cleaned up, and I can go ahead and open it. And that's all there is to it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I have been Jaded. Have a good day.